Hey Gemini, we are here to do your October 2021 reading. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. All I ask is that you please hit the thumbs up if you feel this resonates with you. Um, it so helps with my channel and it really helps with the energy. Also subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. Um, you guys are fantastic, I have to tell you. And um, yeah, so feel free to subscribe, hit that notification bell, and uh, it will let you know when I post new videos. I do a daily every day from Monday through Friday, early in the morning, so you can kind of uh, see what the day might have in store for you. It's a quick reading, and it doesn't take up much time. I know a lot of people are getting ready to do their thing, right? This isn't going to resonate with everyone, but it will resonate with someone. So please take what resonates and leave the rest behind. All right, now that the spiel is over, let's get to it. Universe guides, angels, and spirits. What's going on with Gemini, please? October 2021. What does Gemini need to know, please? Thank you. One more card for Gemini, please. Gemini, please. Thank you. Perfect. First card out, Gemini. All that glitters. All that glitters. Things aren't always as they seem, right, Gemini? Uh, this is card. This card breaks down to number seven, and that talks about um, possible challenges, right? And you know, things that just they're not what they seem now and again right and that's disappointing that could be disappointing but we'll see let's see what's going on I'll put you in front of mr crow nameless crow and then we have by the book and this is card number 11 by the book so you know gemini i feel that in the month of october you're going to learn um if it's not simply one person you're going to learn about a couple of people and um, you know what their true intentions are either with you or in a situation that you are also involved in but let's let's uh, before I go any further with my um, thoughts on this let's pull some cards okay all right let's see Universe guides, angels, and spirits. What else can you tell Gemini, please, for October 2021? What else does Gemini need to know, please? October 2021. One more shuffle. Ooh. All right. That was a woof. <laughs> All right, Gemini, please. I hope everybody is doing well. Okay, what do we have here? The Six of Cups, the Star, the Hermit, the Four of Wands. Okay. And we have Temperance, Page of Wands, Ace of Swords, and Three of Cups. Underneath the deck, Six of Swords. Okay. Gemini, I feel like somebody is coming towards you in the month of October. This could be someone from the past. This could be someone who you might have children with. They're coming forward to you in the month of October, and they're going to give you a whole kit and caboodle um, story about, you know, how you're their everything. And, and, you know, I feel like this could be a situation that maybe had paused for a while, and now they're coming back. And, um, you know, once you guys have, once you have started healing from a situation, well, guess what? Here they come, right? What's that song? Here you come again. 
right? One of those uh, types of deals. We have the Hermit. Some of, you're going to have to do some serious thinking about this because this is for your long term. You know, you have plans. You have, you have plans moving forward, right? Plans for stability for a. a you know a beautiful home front and and I don't mean that monetarily wise I mean beautiful in your mind you know your home is what you make of it right and here comes this person you know coming back from uh, you know rising up and saying hey Gemini um, I've really missed you and uh, let's 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 see what what we can you know work out here you were very patient with this person, I feel. I feel that you gave this person multiple opportunities, multiple chances, and a lot of time to come and make things right. And I feel like all you ever wanted was, you know, a, a chance with this person. I feel like the chemistry is like off the charts and I feel like you wanted to move forward you had big dreams with this person right and um, you spoke your mind to this person and you had to cut them out because they weren't pulling their weight I feel like once you spoke your mind they kind of dipped right you didn't see much of them they kind of dipped they kind of went you know within and you were like what the hell is going on here you are doing things by the book and um, you know this person comes in and with the all that glitters card it's not the person that you thought it you know they're trying to convince you that it's the person you thought it was or could have been and the person's not um, we have the three of cups which also represents a type of rec reconciliation perhaps but this could also represent a third party that could be why this person dipped don't know doesn't have to be this could still mean reconciliation you have a reconciliation card in the beginning you have one in the end so perhaps this person's true intentions is to reconcile with you but we do have to pull some more cards to see hold on one sec Okay. Spirit, what else can you tell Gemini, please, for the month of October 2021? What else can you tell Gemini, please? All right, let's find out what's going on here. Why is the Six of Cups here, please, for Gemini? Thank you. Yeah. So this person knows that they left you, be, you know, be behind. And they know that they left you. And they know that they hurt you. They're coming back now. Underneath the deck, the, the Eight of Wands, they want to talk to you. They want to come back and they want to talk to you. Why is the star here, please? The star? You've been very patient waiting for this person, Gemini. I don't know if you're going to take this person up on their offer. The star, please. Why is the star here? Please, thank you. Look at this. The star. Clarifying the star. Wish fulfillment. You know, this person's taken some time. You've been healing. You've been healing from this. And you're finally moving towards your goal, your happiness, underneath the deck, the King of Wands. Like I said, a lot of chemistry there, a lot of passion there. And this person really knew what to say. This person always had the right words, always had, you know, the perfect things to say. Very convincing, right? Why is the hermit here, please? Why is the hermit here for Gemini? Temperance. Very patient. You've been very patient with this person. You know, that when this person comes back, you are going to go within and think about this situation. 
What I want you to remember though is how patient you have been and I want you to remember the things that happened in the past. Some of these things you can't forget, Gemini, and if I know you like I think I know you, you're not going to forget them and that could cause a burden in the relationship if you choose to go back to this person. Why is the Four of Wands here, please? For Gemini, why is the Four of Wands here for Gemini? Four of Wands, please. Thank you. The Nine of Wands. <laughs> You're going to be defensive, for sure. You're going to be defensive. But you know what? For some of you, I'm feeling like you're going to... Um, listen and you're going to possibly give this person another chance the nine of wands is someone who's been through it but hasn't isn't giving up right um, been through it isn't giving up and I feel like Gemini with with this um, that's you um, some of you anyway um, you guys don't get knocked down that easily but when you do um, you know, you, you, you like to give people the benefit of the doubt. When you get hurt to the point where there's no, um, you know, it, 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 the worst it could be, that's when you give up. Otherwise, if this person kind of di just dipped and whatever and, you know, you still have some love in you, you're going to give it another chance. And you know what? That's, that's fine and dandy, but just... Again, just be careful and listen if you're going to listen to this person. Why is temperance here? Why is temperance here? This one flipped, so I'm taking it. The Queen of Cups. You have a lot of love. You had a lot of love for this person. And I feel like you still do, Gemini. You know, there is that fear of being left out one more time. But this person is going to be so convincing that... Once again, you may actually get swayed towards their way. Okay, why is the Page of Wands here, please? And you know, I, I like to tell the truth and I like to, um, you know, if I'm excited about something, you know I get excited and I, tell, I am totally honest. But you know, if something doesn't feel right, I'm going to be totally honest with that too, you know? The two of... The Two of Swords came out for the Page of Wands. Guarding your heart. Guarding your heart and making a choice, right? What are you going to do? I see the moon here. That, to me, represents there's a little bit of fear. You know, this water isn't super calm either. I'm looking at this water. It is not super calm either. So you know that there is a chance that this things could get, you know, a little rough now and again, right? Why is the Ace of Swords here? Why is the Ace of Swords here? Now remember, you had to cut this person out at one time. We have the Page of Wands again. This person is coming in to speak their truth, to say they want to move forward with you. They want a new beginning with you. They, um, you know, the type of person who's very attractive, very charming, right? Underneath the deck, we have the death card. So they know that it, it was over for you. It was done with you, right? They want to come back and change that. I think that they feel that, you know, with their ego, they love it if, if and because it's happened before, right? When you two, you know, part ways uh, for a little bit and then they come back and convince you, it's like, ha ha, you know, so be careful with that. Why is the Three of Cups here, please? For Gemini, Three of Cups. All right, we have two cards that wanted to flip. Oh, Gemini. All right. The Two of Pentacles. The Two of Pentacles represents juggling to me at times. And I feel like this person may either have someone still or had someone. The Ten of Pentacles. This re represents family to me, right? Stability and family. I feel this person, I feel this person may have someone on the side, if not an entire family on the side. So, like I said, you're going to have to be really, really careful. I have a new book. I'm going to pull a page from this book, Gemini, 
it's the book of answers and this entire book the entire book is like guided answers to questions we may have and this book is so phenomenal i've been playing around with it some i'm going to ask a question and i'm just going to stop and we're going to get an answer all right gemini okay what advice do you have for gemini regarding this situation what advice do you have for gemini stop right here settle it soon that's what the book says settle it soon can you see that settle it soon whatever situation that is not settled between you and this person settle it soon any other messages please spirit any other messages okay you will need to accommodate so i'm saying i'm feeling that spirit is saying listen to this person you'll need to listen to this person before you can make the decision that you want to make um I tell you this book is phenomenal it, it it never lets me down it hasn't let me down yet Gemini this is your reading for October um, just know someone is coming back you have free will you can choose whatever path you wish to to take it's up to you um, I love 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 you guys if this resonates with you please leave a comment let me know and please don't forget to hit that thumbs up um, I will talk to you very soon. Have a fantastic month. Take care, Gemini. Bye.